What kind of villainous activity are we doing today? I have a super evil plan. Let's go to the PJ Mask headquarters and make it disappear. They're gonna be so confused. It's gonna be hilarious. I love it. I love it. Little girl, that is a great idea. Let's do it. But Romeo, first we need to fuel up. Let's eat a good meal, that way we have plenty of energy. Great idea, Luna Girl. What are you gonna eat? I'm gonna eat a Kit Kat. They're super tasty. Nom, 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 nom. What are you gonna eat to fuel up, Romeo? Well, I love seafood. And I found this blue crab from the grocery gang. It's gonna fuel me right up. Nom, 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 nom. Hold on, Romeo. Did you just eat a super gross crab from the grocery gang? I did. It was a blue crab, but it tasted kind of off. Oh no, Romeo. You're not supposed to be eating crabs from the grocery gang. They look super gross, and they're not even real crabs. They're not. Oh no. What's going to happen? I ate the whole thing. Oh my goodness, this isn't good. Hold on, what isn't good? Maui, I just ate a blue crab from the grocery gang. I don't know what's going to happen. You ate a blue crab from the grocery gang? That's not good. What if you get brain belly? Brain belly? Who's having brain belly? That's no fun. Rubble, Romeo ate a blue crab from the grocery gang. He's not feeling well. Oh, that is terrible. Having brain belly is no fun. I can vouch for that. A brain belly is no fun. It really isn't any fun, Romeo. I know it's not fun. My tummy hurts. High five, Romeo. High five. Emoji movie high five. I am not going to high five you right now. I have brain belly. Oh, oh, that was bad timing on my part. That's my bad. Romeo. You shouldn't eat the blue crab from the grocery gang. That's going to get you brain belly. Oh my goodness, I know, but I already ate it. You're right, I shouldn't have eaten that blue crab. Oh, poor Romeo. Oh, poor Romeo. You're having brain belly. Brain belly is the worst. Oh, thanks, Cinderella. I don't want to have brain belly. Do you know anybody who can fix me up? Well, dear Romeo... Fortunately for you, I know Doc McStuffins. Do you think Doc McStuffins can help me? Of course I do. Doc McStuffins is a brilliant doctor and she can help anyone. Hey, Romeo. Doc McStuffins. I ate a blue crab and now I think I have brain belly. Well, don't you worry, Romeo. The doctor is here and I will fix you right up. But you have to promise me to be nice to people from now on, even though you're a villain. Okay, Doc McStuffins, I'll try. Oh, whoa, ladies and gentlemen, here is the brain belly of Romeo. Let's fix him right up. This is a very serious operation. Let's see what's inside of Romeo's brain belly, and let's see if we can get him feeling better. Remember, when you're doing a brain belly operation, you need a super precision tool. This time we have a little scoop. Let's get to work. Let's see what's in this brain belly. Oh my goodness, I'm already seeing something. What is it? Oh my goodness sakes. What is that? Is that Night Ninja? Night Ninja stuck in a brain belly. Oh my goodness, poor Night Ninja. All right, what else do we have in this brain belly? Let's keep digging. It looks like we've got something pink right here. Let's keep digging it out. Oh, wow. It's big and it's pink. I wonder what it is. It looks like a giant box just sitting in his brain belly. It's pink, it's blue. It's got a little heart right there. And it's got a little handle. So you can carry it around. But let's see what's inside. Oh, whoa, whoa. Whoa, what is that? We have something with pink shoes on, some troll toes, and a bunch of green hair. I think we found Fuzzbert. You know Fuzzbert from the Trolls movie? He's a super funny character because you never see his face. Oh, poor Fuzzbert. 
you were stuck in a brain belly. All right, friends, let's keep digging. I think we have something right here. Who is this? Oh my goodness. We have a pig with a flower on the front. I think we found Peppa Pig. She's one of our favorite characters. She's super nice. She's super friendly. She loves all of her friends. Poor Peppa. She was stuck in a brain belly. Do you like Peppa Pig? If you like Peppa Pig, let us know how much you love Peppa Pig by commenting down below. All right, what else is in this brain belly? Let's keep digging. Oh, whoa, what is that? Well, friends, it looks like we found a Shopkins World Vacation to Shopkins in a twin room. This is a super awesome Shopkins toy surprise, and we should open it up. But let's finish this brain belly first. Let's put this aside, and we'll open it up last. All right, let's keep digging. What's inside of this brain belly? What else does Romeo have? And oh my goodness. Oh my goodness, look who we found. We found the snowman from the movie Frozen. He's so funny, isn't he? He's one of the funniest characters. We love him. All right, let's keep digging. Who else is in this brain belly? Oh, oh, I think there's something right here. Uh-oh. Uh-oh, look at that. Look at that. Well, friends, this little character is purple, has sparkles on it, and she's waving hello. Hello. Now this, now this little character, friends, is the first question of the day. She, and I'll give you a hint who she is. She is friends with Vampirina Ballerina. Now, if you know who this is, make sure to comment down below. Let us know. Do you know who this is? All right, let's keep digging. Who else is in this brain belly? Or what else is in this brain belly? Uh-oh, uh-oh, there's something right here. Oh, whoa, I think we found a My Little Pony. This My Little Pony is pink and purple with some white hair and has a blue tiara and blue eyes. She's super cute. This is the second question of the day. Do you know who this My Little Pony is? If you know who this is, comment down below. All right, let's keep digging. What else is in this brain belly? Oh, I think, I think we found something right here. Who is this? He's yellow, he has overalls. He's got a pig nose, goggles. Oh my goodness, did we find a minion? We did find a minion. And what do minions eat? Say it with me. Banana, banana. That's right, they love bananas. All right, let's keep digging. What else is in this brain belly? Uh-oh, uh-oh. I think we found something right here. Oh, gross, we found a dog from the ugliest pet shop. This little guy has yellow wonky eyes. He's got a bone in his mouth and he's got some green slobber. That is super gross. Ah, oh, gross. All right, what else is in this brain belly? Is there anything else? Let's see here. I think everything is out of this brain belly. Now it's time to open our Shopkins. This Shopkins has two Shopkins in a twin room. I wonder what we got. Let's open it up. Here's one surprise Shopkins. Here's another surprise Shopkins. And here's our Shopkins guide. Today we could get something from the French Adventure. We could get Chantel Chou or Selena Krupp or Ella Tower Cake or we could get something from the UK holiday, like Spencer Sponge, or High Tea Helen, or Majestic Heels. Or if you flip it over, we could get something from the Italian tour, or the German jet set, or the special edition bag charms. I wonder which one we got. Oh, whoa, look at that. I wonder what that is. 
It's light blue. It's got some yellow and some red on top. Let's find out. It looks like we found Freddy Fish and Chips from the UK holiday. Oh, I love Freddy Fish and Chips. I wonder who else we got. All right, our other Shopkins is pink, has a purple hat with a green, a green blue little feather on top. She's giving us a wink. I wonder who she is. Oh, wow, look at that. We got, from the German jet set, a Papa Pretzel. Oh, that is so cool. I love Papa Pretzel. Well, friends, now that we've opened up our super awesome Shopkins, Let's go find out if Romeo is feeling any better. Oh, I hope he feels better. Romeo, I was able to fix your brain belly right up. But there's a lot of really interesting things in there. Doc McStuffins, thank you so much for fixing my brain belly. From now on, I'm going to give up my life of crime. And I'm going to try to be a good person. Well, friends, Romeo ate a bad crab, and he got brain belly. But Doc McStuffins was able to fix him right up. Now, if you're happy that Romeo is feeling better, make sure to give him a big thumbs up. And of course, if you haven't yet, make sure to subscribe to Tons of Toys. That way you don't miss out, and you don't want to miss out on any fun videos. Have a great day. Bye-bye.